wasn't Kanye West that put the White Lives Matter t-shirt on first. You did. You did by intentionally ignoring what Black Lives Matter would actually mean if it was applied. And it's people like this that are exactly the reason why I say what I say in the way that I say it. I'm about to eat through your shit. Now rewind. Let's run this shit back point by point. It wasn't Kanye West that put the White Lives Matter t-shirt on first. You did. You did by intentionally ignoring what Black Lives Matter would actually mean if it was applied. The simultaneous gall and irony of somebody who's on a network that is literally funded by fossil fuel billionaires to push a conservative worldview telling us that we deliberately ignore what BLM would mean is fucking crazy to me. To the simultaneous gall and irony of you telling the black community, look what you made me do when both you and Kanye West are incredibly wealthy and could be educated on these topics if you gave a fuck is crazy to me. Three, the fact that you don't fucking realize that you saying black people are ignoring the issues in the community, thus you had to put on the White Lives Matter shirt is implicitly suggesting that White Lives Matter is antithetical to Black Lives Matter is fucking crazy to me. Meaning the whole shit about ALM and oh, don't forget about white people because we go through shit too was literally just all bullshit according to your logic. Don't you have some media training? How did y'all watch that footage back and not realize that you just contradicted the fuck out of yourself? And for we'll get to the discussion about what Black Lives Matter would actually mean in a minute after I let you get up real quick. It would mean taking a look at the real problem that is happening, which is our culture. A celebration of perversity pitched to us as if it's diversity. It's not. It is not diversity that we are celebrating. It is perversity. You said the same thing twice and both times it meant less than nothing. One, where does culture come from, Candace? Tell me where. If you're trying to make the argument that black people are just genetically predisposed to have a bad culture, please do, and you'll get blown the fuck out of the water. But if I'm gonna be charitable to you and assume you're not making that argument, you have to acknowledge that culture comes from environment. And I wonder if there's a connection between the environment in which black people in America were placed in and the outcomes in their culture and socioeconomic status. See, the difference with me is I don't just say shit, I back it up. Here's a study on racism and the effects of the mental health of black people. Reviewing the evidence that points to a myriad of ways that racism can have a negative impact on black people. Oh, but it gets worse for you. Let's run back what you just showed in your video. It would mean taking a look at the real problem that is happening, which is our culture. Please tell me how the fuck a BLM protest is the real problem happening in the black community. And then you showed Cardi B as if to say that hip hop and the culture around that is the actual problem in the black community. And now I'm about to show you fundamentally why that's fucking stupid. This goes for anyone out there who believes this too. Here's a study on gang violence in LA, significantly linking proportion of employment and per capita income to gang-related activity. Or we can look at socioeconomic status as a fundamental cause of street criminality. And the studies can keep coming because this is not up for fucking debate. The very basis of some of these rap songs that you guys love to talk about are coming from the environment in which black people were placed in and their socioeconomic status. Rap in itself did not stem from the happy-go-lucky circumstances of black people in America. So telling rappers to shut up about their experiences still does not fix the fucking system. And before you say black father, Listeners take a gander at where they're going. Blaming an outcome for the wrong of a system is as stupid as blaming dishes for not being washed properly and not the dishwasher. And this deliberately shitty line of argumentation you love to engage in stems from the tendency of racist people to view black people as more violent and their culture as problematic. But let me make something abundantly clear. You do not care about these issues. If you did, I'm looking forward to your peer-reviewed response to the evidence. If not, keep tap dancing.